I'm joined by somebody who was one of my first interviews, Mike Clark. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Yeah, you were one of the first on the channel. Oh, cool. I'm, 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 I'm honored. I'm thrilled. <laughs> yeah, it was a battle between you and Jim. No, I, I really love talking to you. So it's um, back then. I asked you a question about being the father of Zen, and you <laughs> yeah. agreed. Yeah. And uh, we, uh, I spoke to Jim, and I put the question to Jim as well, and he said he's more like a crazy uncle. <laughs> sure. So I have to ask, why are you now called the Zen Daddy? <laughs> uh, the team has really uh, liked to turn that phrase from <laughs> Zen Daddy. I, you know, it really, you know, when I first heard it, I wasn't that thrilled, but you know, it kind of grows on you. I don't know. It's fun. <laughs> um, Engineers need a little bit of fun, I guess, right? So, is there anybody on the engineering team you want to thank? Oh, I want to thank uh, everybody. It's just such an incredible team. I mean, and there's, there's such a range, too. I mean, there's old timers like me, like I've been doing it 31 years. There, you'd be surprised how many people. Uh, were there back on K5, and even before K5, I get it, you know, shame sometimes. There's people that have been working there longer than me and that are still there. But then we, you know, we have guys in the middle of their career. We have got, we have new grads, we have interns. I mean, it's just, and I think you really need that. I mean, it's, as far as, you know, I, I really believe in, uh, you know, it's not uh, new, new good ideas come from everywhere. You, it's like, you know, everyone, think so, oh, you know, look, you have to be a corporate fellow or a senior fellow to have a good idea. No, you don't. Yes, we have more experience. We have the ability to vet your idea and think about it. Maybe, yes, some part of it doesn't make sense, but hey, wait, there's, there's, there's a nugget here that we can work on and pull out. And I always say there's also, you know, we have to be careful not to fall in the trap of, oh yeah, we studied that five years ago. It was worth nothing. That things change and ideas that we tried before, I mean, not made it to Silicon, but just, you know, we looked at it, didn't make mm -hmm. sense. Well, someone else is like, why haven't you guys done this? It's like, oh yeah, that might make sense now. Let's go look at it. Oh yeah, you're right. This is worth something. <laughs> Stuff changes, right? We're constantly innovating. And, and even those are essentially new ideas, you know, cause someone had to come and like, you know, knock us in the head and say, wait, why aren't you guys doing this? And you need the young guy, they ask questions and they ask sometimes what I would say, I call them weird questions. But then when I get it, it's like, oh yeah, yeah, we should go look at that. You know what I mean? So um, you've said before, and, and Jim said before, the whole process of Zen um, is uh, design, iterate, Rip it up and start again. <laughs> yeah. Zen 5 is the rip it up. Yes. Um, well, I like to think of it, I would say, you know, sort of our odds have been kind of rip it up. Like yeah. we. Redefine so Zen 3, yeah. But it's still, you know, for Zen 5, we really went in knowing that, you know, we'd been on that, you know, six wide, four LU dispatch. We really <laughs> needed to crack that nut open. And when you do, Lots of stuff needs yeah. to change, whether you want to or not. Yeah. And so um, we went in with that eyes open, and um, yeah, it was like, you know obviously a lot of pressure and risk, but you know the team loved the challenge and uh, happy to say we pulled it off and got it out into the market. It's just so great uh, to represent this great design team. I know, I'll tell you, they you know they are on top of everything. Like they send me every article. <laughs> like I. <laughs> I can't keep up with this stuff, but they sent it to me, and so yes, we, you know, we'll talk about it, and and they're great, and they, they have the pa same passion that I've mm -hmm. always had, and and that's what we, you know, the culture we try to breed, the, uh, the people we try to look for, because I'd like to say it's this is not a job, it's like a lifestyle, yeah, 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 right? Yeah. So your so, life is invested in this. So one last question, so uh, this is, has to be very quick. Okay. Um, Looking at all the design choices in Zen 5, you know, the, the whole dual uh, four-way decoders, the dual porting, um, the changes to the back end, why is it only 16% IPC? So, I, I mean, I think it comes down to that, um, you know, we're really, well, we needed to move the foundation. Mm -hmm. We need, software has to see that so it can really leverage that foundation. And so, you know, as people have been, you know, uh, doing software techniques, writing software, when you're stuck on that kind of that six-wide dispatch 4LU, I mean, you don't get the return 
of putting all this work into your software and trying to make it wider and trying to find the branches and make basic blocks bigger. And so, um, yeah, I think as you'll, you'll see, as Zen 5 gets out in the world and, pe and software starts to develop on it, it's going to be way more than mm. that. And it's also going to make Zen 6 and Zen 7 look much better. And the, the Zen 5 guys are going to be like, man, that's our work. You know, they're leveraging. They didn't put that much in. It's because we put it in and they're leveraging it, you know? So, so, so two things. One, it's 16% now, maybe more. Yeah, and I mean, really, like we you should said, it's it an S curve. And... and you should test it. But we did, I say, and you should keep us yeah. honest, that we, you know, there are obviously because of the the 512 bit data path, there yeah. are workloads that can do a lot yeah. more than 16%. Yeah. And there are things that don't leverage that. They, mm -hmm. you know, they were really tuned for the old interface. And they, you know, it's hard to make those <laughs> things. They're already running at a really high IPC. There's yep. just only so much you can do, right? And one thing, you may have heard him <laughs> confirm Zen 7. <laughs> did I say that? <laughs> you yeah. did. Well, you've already you've said Zen 8 before, so okay. we know it's coming. Yeah. Thank you very much. Although, yeah, we always cool. reserve the right to uh, come up with a new name, but... Oh, uh, hmm, hmm. So maybe, hmm. yeah. Hmm. Maybe so, it so, won't so, be so, Zen so, so you won't be the Zen Daddy. You'll be the... Uh, <laughs> some... <laughs> yeah. I heard Nirvana being mentioned earlier. Uh, we'll leave that for another yeah, video. Okay, okay, all right. <laughs> Thank hey, you very much, man. It's great always great to see you. Yeah. 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 yeah, we'll play bowling later. Yeah. Yeah, sounds good. <laughs>